Right, hello and welcome back. Let's play Metroid Prime 2. Echoes. So yeah, last time we got ourselves the space jump boots from, well, said Guardian. Now we've got to go to um, where those space pirates were because we've got some base raiding to do. Even earlier than before. From where before we had Fendrana. Now, hold on a sec, what's this? It's a statue. A warning. Couldn't be relevant to us, surely. No, not in the least. Also, after I read this logbook, real quick. Mm-hmm. Ah, so the energy controllers were to stop it from going haywire. Also, I believe my beloved map station is actually down here. So do forgive me as I take a quick detour. And with any luck. Hello? There we are. I knew it was behind one of these doors. Can I skip the little cutscene? No, apparently not. Also, my ear is itchy. Do forgive me for that. But yes, apart from ear itching, we have all this. Two ways connecting to the temple. Some weird stuff over there. And the pirate base, which we've yet to sort of fully explore, but don't worry, that comes now. As soon as I climb back up again. Yeah, sorry about that. I should have gone here first. Ignoring the sand digger, <laughs> no. Have to climb up here first. There we are. I believe we'll be getting some new beam weaponry soon enough as well. That's uh, fairly radical, yes. Right, so which way was I going? That way? That way. Well, actually, no, hold on a sec. Since I can double jump, I could have just turned around. Whoops. It's hard to believe someone f waged a war here. It doesn't seem like the best place for combat. But then when you're dealing with a bunch of sort of sociopathic aliens, I, I guess not. Also, putting this up will allow me to do this. Allow me to get an energy tank. I am always happy to pick up an energy tank or five. Right, good. Where am I now? Well, I know exactly where I am. I'm here. Pirates back by any chance? Doesn't seem like it. Well, they'll be getting a visit from me, whether they like it or not. Hopefully I can get a few of their logs in this episode, that'll be grand. So I'm trying to uh, ignore the indigenous life as best I can. Alright, so let's jump on the statue of this child hero. There we are. And... No, oh, it's more lore. The Stellar Object. This will be important in the third game. Yep. Yeah, shit went south rather quickly. Also, no, I... Sorry. Scan visor. Behave. Right. Opening the floodgates. Or the sand gates. Hmm. Well, whatever the case. Going, going, going. And in. Oh yeah. It is pirate time. Oh, do they already know I'm here? Oh. Let's create a phase on if I can... Ha! Nice. That's what you get for messing with phase on pirates. Will they learn their lesson by the end of this game? If you guess no. You're correct! What's all this? Yep. Oh, hold on. Oh, here we go. Also, that ship I'm going to want to scan real quick before it goes, because I think that's a one-time scan. The pirate skiff. Hmm. 
indeed. Well, too late for that now, isn't it? Are these the same pirates? Yeah, they are. They're just regular troopers. Improved they may be, and then they just pass right through him. Well, whatever. Hi. Bye. Here come more. Teleporting in now, in fact. I thought those were commandos, but apparently not. Hello. And goodbye. Oh, no, never mind. How does that work? Oh well, whatever the case, they've jumped into these bad boys here. If I can have a quick scan. Vigilance class. You can hide behind these things. They will blow these wind turret things up, I think, if you let them. Hi. And that'll do it. Yeah, sucks to be you guys. Also, this room will also be important later. I believe this is necessary to um, get one of the, well, collectibles, shall we say, later in the game. Which is a shame. The artifacts from the first game were far easier to find. In this game, you have to find the person in order to go to the Dark World equivalent to find the key. It's a bit annoying. But we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. First, we need to take care of the various temples, and that will in itself take a good while, actually. Like I said, significantly longer than the first game. But hey. Right, now we're dealing with some serious pirate stuff. So that's a dark door. And that's a light door. I am getting through neither of those. So, what I'm going to want to do is break this. Hop on down. And through. And right into the heart of a space pirate fortress. Ow. And it's a lightning as well. Oh, there are pirate commandos. Hi. And they're running headlong into Dark Aether. You guys have fun with that. I'm not going to stop you. I'm all for a good suicide mission. Have they seen me yet? I think so. Hi. I believe there are some logs to scan in here, if I'm not mistaken. There are some crates to collect. Oh, we have a lot in here, don't we? Also. They've apparently mapped Dark Aether. Contains high levels of Phazon ore. Who'd have thought? Right, let's see what we got here. Phazon raids. Mm hmm. Those are certainly going well, aren't they? Cannot fail. I like that word. Cannot. Lots of room for error. So it is. Right, let's scan the rest of these logs and be on our way. Phase on operations. Ah, uh, that's when they detected phase on here in the first place. Yeah, they kind of did kick the Marines' ass when they got here. Next one. Local conflict. Class 4 conflict. I wonder what that entails. Well, probably what I'm delivering to the Space Pirates right now, in all honesty, but... Great discoveries, huh? I'm sure. And Rift Portal. The Dark Beam, you say? Oh, skip that a bit too far, but still dark beam. Okay, and last but not least, 
That's Aether itself. Any of these really important? Ah, right. And this, I believe, activates an elevator. There we are. You wouldn't be able to scan these. No, they're not really useful. It will basically just say this is an elevator. Well done, gold star, but hopping over here. That's a light door, and that's a pirate. Nope. Okay. These, any importance? Anything here I should know about? Security alert, huh? Hello there. Okay, bye. Right, can't scan anything from here, so... Oh, oh shit. You look kind of cool. No, don't go. Oh, that's unfortunate. What, what have I got here as well? Oh, another log. Federation attack. The Dark Hunter. I don't suppose they mean that thing over there, do they? Dark energy, huh? Looks like we need that dark beam. Yeah. That thing they were talking about. Boom. Any dark beam in here? Not that I can see, but there is this. I'll gladly take that and open it. Thank you very much. So yeah, no idea what that bloody clone is doing, but... Hmm. They call it the Dark Hunter, indeed. Seems legit. But hey, now those blast doors are open, I can... make some headway. Command center, of course. Oh, no. Hello. Humility class turret. It's a bloody Federation knockoff. It could be just bloody destroyed by a single charge shot, no less. It's a bit easy, isn't it? Right. Doop. Fancy. Dang. How the hell did you dodge that? Oh god, not again. Oh Jesus, hi. Hey there. So they're pissing off a bunch of Metroids, which have now got this lovely red hue. Why they're here, however, is another story. Is there anything here that tells us why they're here? What about you? You can stun a Metroid like that? I didn't think that was actually possible. Oh well. Elevator, please. Danke. Oh, hi guys. Oh. Can't really sick the Metroids on you this time, so you should probably be thankful. Hi. And goodbye. So, what we got in here? Ah, you can scan them. Talon Metroids. And, yeah. They were literally just taken straight from Talon 4 and brought here, and now they're red for some reason. There's no bloody plasma beam here. Yeah, they're vulnerable to dark energy because it's cold. Metroids are weak to cold. In fact, every creature on the light world is weak to the dark beam. And, spoilers, when you eventually do get the light beam, every dark creature is weaker to that. So, you would do well to remember it. Okay, Metroid. Several pet treats. Aha! 
That's um Okay. They are doing some weird things to these Metroids. Also, is that a log? So it is. The Hunter. Yeah, yes I have. Oh, they're not referring to me. Ah, uh, looks like they've run into that copy. Also, there's a pirate in there as well. Owned. Also, there's a bunch of bloody phase on in there, isn't there? That's great. They're feeding it. They're feeding them phase on a home. Oh. No. No, thank you. So it is. I'll be quick to fix that. Ah, good, good. Right, what we got? That looks nice and not foreboding. Yeah, I figured. Right. Oh, you guys again, huh? Pirate Aero Troopers, you know them from the last game. If you were watching, they fly around, they shoot you, you blow them up, they try and kill themselves. Or, well, kamikaze attack, I suppose they were dead anyway. Nope. It's not happening, pirates. What is happening, however, is that... Alright, so... There's two sides to this thing. Basically, what you have to do... Also, that's an energy tank up there. An energy tank, thank you very much. Basically, these raise and lower the platforms. What I'm going to want to do first, before I use it to reach the next room... Ha! Huh, is that not the one that raises it? Can I... Oh, it's offline, sorry. I have to scan the big panel first. That's a magnetic rail track. Okay, never mind, have to go over to this side first. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Rolling upstairs is hardly conducive. Oh, there we are. Now it's active. And the game says, go towards the door. I say, fuck that. Um, what I'm going to do is, yeah, grab that energy tank first and foremost. And then go to that door. I've done this puzzle a hundred million times, so it should be good. So this one lowers it, as I recall. Yep. Let's do it again. And again. That'll probably do it. That, so there's two. And then we lower that one, but a mere one. Hello. That'll do it. Oh, so that's a green door. Super missiles. Actually, can't wait for those. Those are cool. These things are also cool. Danke schön. Splat. Right, okay. Now we do things as they were meant to be done. Raise that. Raise that. No, hold on a minute. I didn't need to do that at all. What I need to do is raise that by two. Oh, sorry. My bad again. Yeah, there we have it. I I get it, game. I beat the puzzle. I'm quite clever, I am. Hop, skip, and a jump. There should be a save point just ahead, so I can probably end this episode off. Plus, there's one hell of a boss fight coming. Hmm. 
Nope. Also, this spring ball makes this a hell of a sight easier. Ow! Lasers don't, however. So, do be careful. Probably make it. Yeah. Oh, oh god. Bit of a disaster. No biggie. I can make it back there at my leisure. Okay. Right. Obvious save room before boss battle, but before that we can read this. Security breach. Mm-hmm. Indeed. Nope. Well, at that case, I'd better save then. Before taking on the Dark Hunter, as it were. Rightio. So yes, <clears throat> next time we'll do that. And hopefully get some access to some new weaponry and whatnot. See you all then.